second one three sin square x plus phi cos square x let us find out the minimum and maximum value of this function or range of this function or we may call it as extreme values of this function. So, let us say f of x is equal to 3 sin square x plus phi cos square x. Now, 3 multiplied by sin square x is equal to 1 minus cos 2 x by 2 and plus phi multiplied by 1 plus cos 2 x by 2. Now, 2 is the LCM, 3 minus 3 cos 2 x plus phi plus phi cos 2 x. Here, phi plus 3 is 8 and phi cos 2 x minus 3 cos 2 x is plus 2 cos 2 x and divided by 2. From numerator take 2 common, we get 4 plus cos 2 x by 2, this 2 2 gets cancelled. Now, the function becomes 4 plus cos 2 x. 4 plus cos 2 x. Now, we know that the range of cos 2 x function is minus 1 comma 1. That means, cos 2 x lies between minus 1 and 1. So, minus 1 less than or equal to cos 2 x less than or equal to 1. Now, add 4, throughout we have to add 4, we get 3 less than or equal to 4 plus cos 2 x less than or equal to 5. What is 4 plus cos 2 x? Nothing but given function f of x. So, therefore, 3 less than or equal to f of x less than or equal to 5. The f of x lies in between 3 and 5. 3 is the minimum and 5 will be the maximum. So, extreme values are minimum is 3, maximum is 5. So, minimum value of the function is 3, whereas maximum value is 5. Sixth problem, if a less than or equal to cos theta plus 3 root 2 sin of theta plus pi by 4 plus 6 less than or equal to b, then find the largest largest of a and the smallest smallest of b okay that means indirectly here extreme values of this function only we have to find out so, let us consider f of theta not x, f of theta in terms of theta function is. So, cos theta plus 3 root 2 sin of theta plus pi by 4 plus 6. Okay. Now, let us find out sin of a plus b value. What is sin of a plus b? sin a cos b plus cos a sin b. So, using that formula, 
Now this can be written as cos theta plus 3 root 2 and sin theta cos 45 cos pi by 4 plus cos theta sin pi by 4 plus 6. Now, cos 45 and sin 45 both are same equal to 1 by root 2. So, this can be written cos theta plus 3 root 2 into sin theta into 1 by root 2 plus cos theta into 1 by root 2 and plus 6. Now, multiply each term with 3 root 2. Let us see what do we get. Cos theta plus root 2 root 2 cancel 3 sin theta next plus root 2 root 2 cancel 3 cos theta plus 6. Now, adding these two, so we can write 3 sin theta plus 4 cos theta plus 6. How does it appear? It appears to be in the form of a sin theta plus b cos theta plus c. What are the extreme values of a sin theta plus b cos theta plus c? Already in the earlier session we have discussed. The minimum value is equal to c minus root of a square plus b square, whereas maximum value is equal to c plus root of a square plus b square. That means, in order to find out those values first, comparing with this one to the a sin theta plus b cos theta plus c, we get here a equals to 3, b equals to 4, c equals to 6. Now, minimum value, minimum is equal to here a c minus root of a square plus b square. So, c minus c means 6 minus root of 3 square 9 plus 16 that is 6 minus root 25 that is 6 minus 5 which equals to 1. The minimum value is 1. Let us go for maximum. What is the maximum? c plus root of a square plus b square. So, this equals to 6 plus root of 9 plus 16 same only just sign change 6 plus root 25 6 plus 5 is 11. But the problem is given so in the form of here this is f of theta. So, we can write it lies between 1 and 11. 1 less than or equal to f of theta less than or equal to 11. Here comparing with a equals to 1 and b equals to 11. The smallest value of b is 11 and whereas the largest value of a is how much 1. So, that means here a equals to 1 and b equals to 11.